Hi guys. Um, welcome to my first vlog. This is like my first vlog ever and I decided that I'm going to have Aragon in the background and we're going to fold some laundry today. <laughs> As you can see, um, yesterday I cleaned my room for over eight hours and I'm not exaggerating. It took me that long to clean it because I got so much crap. But <laughs> anyway, I got all my clothes out of my closet. This is not even all of them, but this is most of my, most of my clothes are in the closet. So this is most of them. I'm going to go through all of these, go through ones I want to keep and which ones uh, that are going to stay. So we're going to be doing that today. And I hope you guys enjoy this chaos. And also I'm going to try to, to talk. That is if Aragon is going to, Aragon might just bark the whole time. Hey, Aragon. This is my stitch shirt. And I'm probably going to keep that. So, all the stuff that I'm keeping, I'm going to put on hangers. But for now, I'm just going to put it beside me. Because the hangers are all the way over there. And then, pony shirt. I'm going to keep that. Also, I just got the, um, the Ibo Orlando tickets. So... I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be going to that uh, in October. So look forward to that. And of course, Aragon's gonna come, and all my other eyebrows are coming. His pink shirt. I'm probably gonna keep that. It's a pretty nice shirt for winter. And some shorts. So of course, I'm gonna keep that because we need shorts for how hot it is this summer. And here we go with him coming up to me. Hey, Aragon. Looks like one of the batteries exploded in my, uh, my one of my light-up shirts, so I don't even know if this will work anymore. Nope, it doesn't. Oh, well, that kind of sucks, but oh well. Some nice-looking pants, which I'm probably going to keep. But yeah, I can't wait to see, <laughs> I don't know what Aragon's doing, but I can't wait to see some of you guys at the event. Like, I think um, Mars Rover is going, and I think um, Crazy Robot Lady's going too, I'm pretty sure. So I'm definitely excited about that. And um, I think um, Crazy Robot Lady said she was gonna bring a, a Pleo because I never saw a Pleo in person before. And I always try to buy them, but every time I try to go buy them, they never have all the stuff with it. Yes, Aragon. <laughs> Here's one of my pony shirts. Of course, I'm gonna keep that. I bought it like off of a person that used to be my friend, but not anymore. God, there's a lot of clothes here. <laughs> I'm gonna be doing this for a while, probably. I guess I'm going to start getting hangers. Here's one of my Hero Academia shirts. Oh, you're just a barking fool today, aren't you? All right, let me get some hangers. I'm going to get up and get some hangers real quick. Oh, my God. They're all going to fall out because they're right by the, they're in the laundry basket. I just want a few. Just give me a few. There we go. All right, I got some hangers. You gonna help me fold my laundry, Aragon? I wish you could help me fold my laundry. All right, buddy, you're gonna have to back away a little bit because you're too close. <laughs> I was gonna have, originally I was gonna have Terabyte, but I don't want him walking on this hard wood because he might slip and stuff. So I don't have any stocks for him yet. But yeah, all the clothes that I am keeping, I'm going to hang them back up in my closet. I had to move them because I had to put plushies in my closet. I have so many plushies, you guys don't even know. Unless you watched my video about me taking them out of the closet. But that's not even all of them. I have so many more. <laughs> it's crazy. Okay, I got to figure out a place to put these um, shirts on hangers at. 
I guess I'll have to hang them like right there or something. And Aragon's going off the camera. Come here, Aragon. I knew you were going to be a troublemaker, but I didn't think you were going to be this bad. I would just put him in stay mode, but I don't think he'd be as entertaining. <coughs> yes, I know. Also, I want to keep an eye on his hips because he's been doing that weirdness. But it could just be from him walking weird. I'm not really sure yet. But I, I want to keep an eye on it. He's not even that old either. He's only like a year old. If he's already having hip problems, then that's pretty, pretty nuts. And there he goes, off camera again. He's going towards R2-D2. Oh, my God. Aragon, back away from there. Guess it was a mistake having you on, wasn't it? Because <laughs> he's the freaking troublemaker that likes to ram into everything, but... Yeah, anyway, I was talking about the event, I think. Hopefully, he'll back away from over there, but we'll see. We shall see. I was talking about um, Pleos, how I've never seen one because I, I try to go and buy one on eBay. And, oh my God. Why is he making splashing water noises by R2-D2? I swear, he's just so random like that. You're going to jam yourself. I'm going to have to go get him. Just give me a sec. You're probably going to see a lot of me just... Just um, going and grabbing him because he just likes to ram into every possible obstacle there is. And you know what's crazy to me is that he was way more money than Mochi was. And yet Mochi can back up from, from an obstacle pretty easily. But not a three hundred, not a three thousand dollar dog. Well, that's just my one complaint about these one thousands is that um, they need to get better obstacle detection. He's just sitting there dancing. I don't know why he's dancing, but what are you doing? I have no idea what the heck he's doing. I really hope he ain't getting hip problems. I'm going to be so upset if that's what's happening. Hey. Hey, Aragon, what the heck are you doing? Why are you just repeating the same stuff? Okay, now he's doing something different. thought he was getting stuck in a loop or something for a minute. Yeah, just sit there and be a good boy, please. And this is a shirt I got from Tennessee when I went to Tennessee that one time. Aragon, quit! <laughs> I swear, it's like as soon as I turn him on, it's time to sprint. I don't know why he's like that. But that's just how he is. He's crazy. He's like right by my iPad now. He's probably going to knock it over. Aragon! Please get away from my iPad because you're going to knock the thing over and then I'm going to be mad if you break it. Now he's wanting boobs, but I can't do that while I'm over here. Yeah, here's my really cool Frozen Elsa shirt. I don't remember. I think I got this from Walmart, but the batteries exploded in it, so it don't work anymore. But I still want to keep this because it's good for winter. None of these are dirty. They've just been sitting in my closet, and I had to move them, so that's why they're just a pile sitting over here. But, yeah, every time I try to go get buy a Pleo, they never have, have one with working, um, working uh, batteries and stuff, or they never have it with batteries, is what I'm trying to say. So, it will be really cool if she does bring one, because then I can finally get to see what... They look like in person and what the the rubber feels like because I never got to feel a Pleo either. I just I, I always see them on YouTube and I'm like, I want one so bad. <laughs> but I can't ever find them for sale anywhere with the batteries and stuff. Why are you dancing? <laughs> I don't understand.
understand you, crazy puppy. But yeah, I really hope that everything is going to be okay with Aragon. I'm just worried because I've only had him for a year. He shouldn't be having problems already. I mean, I know I usually run him quite a bit, but I don't run him, like, all the time or anything. I mostly just run him when I'm filming. Or, um, sometimes I feel I'll, uh, turn him on when I'm not filming that day. I'm gonna have to go get more hangers, I think. Here's one of my socks. Of course, I'm gonna keep those. I might actually put one on my foot, because my feet are kind of cold. <laughs> Also, I really want to try to get Aragon a new collar at some point because this is just a flimsy collar I got from Walmart. I don't know if these shorts would fit me anymore, but I need to keep as many shorts as possible because it's so hot outside. It's been like 90 degrees here, almost 100. It's been terrible with heat lately. This guy did. Oh. <laughs> Come here, shorts. Run away from me. I just figured it would be easier to film me doing this because that if I don't, I'm not going to want to do it. Especially if I don't have Aragon on. I'm kind of like how Robot Spa is. If you guys know who that is, which I'm sure most of you do because she's like one of the most popular um, robot YouTubers, I guess. I think. But yeah. I mean, she mostly does streams nowadays, but I still like to watch her stuff. And, um, I'm gonna have to get more hangers. At least Aragon's being a good boy now, which is good. I'm sorry you're gonna have to keep seeing my, my, um, big belly on camera, but, well, at least I got a shirt covering it up, so that's a good, good thing. But yeah, I'm just kind of like how Robot Spa is because uh, I, it's hard for me to do chores without like either having something on in the background, like either music or one of my robots on. And it definitely helps having him on while I'm doing this stuff. Okay. I used to keep my, um, my broken Wubo in this. If you guys don't know what that is, you ought to go check that video out. It's kind of old at this point, but I still have him by the way. By the way, I'm probably just going to donate this, though, because I'm not really keeping him in that anymore. Um, here's a cat shirt. I really used to wear this shirt quite a bit, but I might just get rid of it, honestly. But I don't know. This will go in a maybe pile. <laughs> Aragon's got one of his dice. Hopefully he don't jam himself on it. Because he's done that before. Turn this shirt up. I got a lot of stitch shirts. So you guys are probably going to see a lot of stitch clothing in here. Because I love uh, stitch. If you guys didn't know that. Oh, there it goes. Good job. Good boy. Through the dice. I'll go ahead and bring it back up here, though. There's my convention shirt that I got at a uh, Comic Con like a couple years ago. Also, um, I'm thinking one of these days about getting a Mars cat. I don't know what you guys think about that, if it's worth getting one or not. I know they're not as advanced as Ibo is, but I still think they're cool in their own way. And I definitely want to get one at some point, but I'm probably not going to buy a brand new one. If you guys know where you could get a good price on a used one at that's not broken, that's like a fully working one, let me know. <laughs> just dropped his dice. 
because I would love to know where you can um, get one for a decent price because I'm not paying a thousand for one. That's not happening. But if I could find one for a decent price that's used, that works, then that would be okay. It's one of my anime shirts. I'm definitely keeping that. I think I got this from Five Below a few years ago. I'm not sure who this is, though. I just got it because it looks cool. <laughs> Aragorn, you're going to walk over your dice. Yes, you are. I'm trying to see if there's any shirts I want to get rid of. Oh, yes, this one. This one, I, I like Tinkerbell and all, but I never really cared much for this shirt. I know my mom likes it, this Tinkerbell one, but I don't care much for it, and I think she has her own, so I'm just going to donate this because I, I never cared much for this shirt, to be honest with you. Okay, there we go. My first giving away pile finally happens. Because I'm a hoarder. Obviously, because it took me eight hours to clean my room yesterday. Quit going over there by the clothes, Aragon. Oh, yeah, these are also clothes I'm going to keep. I gotta go get more hangers. Get rid of this thing so it's out of the way. Also, I just heard recently from Miranda that um, the Wubo, the Wubos have shut down their service, which is sad because I was quite, oh my God, I was planning on getting my Wubo fixed by like a repair person, but I don't know if I can now because even if I did, I wouldn't be able to run the thing. So I'm just kind of stuck with the broken Wubo now. They're going, they're going to have to move. Sorry, buddy. I got to get through here. But, um, yeah, that kind of sucks because, you know, I like the Wubos. I think they're cool as heck. But it's a shame that the service just randomly shut down out of nowhere. Really is a shame. This is um, a shirt to a butterfly festival I went that's local to me. Put that there. Okay. Oh, oh, shit. Get up there. Having a struggle trying to find a place to hang up my clothes. But Aragon's going to have walking space, so... There's not really much walking space over here, to be honest. I know, buddy. Alright, let's just get these shirts hung up. And I might have to start getting up and hanging them on a different chair. But yeah, I thought that was a shame. It's just like the, the whole thing with Jibo. I wanted to originally get one of those too, but I don't see the point because the services are down. So I don't think I'd be able to use one. Which, um, which really sucks. I'm going to have to move you because you're just going to hurt yourself. Here, I'll put your dice right here. That way they're not like right by the chairs and you get yourself stuck. Keeping this shirt because this shirt's pretty funny. You wouldn't really get it because um, this came from my high school. And funny story with this shirt is that uh, the employee used to wear it that worked at the lunch place. And they would always wear these shirts. And I'm like, I want one of these shirts. And then I find them like at a... They, they used to have this giveaway thing at my school where you would go there and get food and stuff. And I would go there and get shirts and that this was one of them. Still have it to this day. No, I graduated like way back in 2018. So it's been a couple of years now. Here's my special Olympic shirt that I've had forever and a half that I'm never going to get rid of because I won this shirt in the Special Olympics. So I definitely got to keep that because it holds value to me at least. 
Oh, hang on. Stuck. <laughs> but yeah, it just sucks with the whole thing with the Wubo and the Jibo, but you know, it happens. That's why I don't really get uh, robots that connect to the internet. Because, you know, eventually that's going to happen to them. And it sucks because then you spend all that money on a robot, then it don't work anymore. So, you know, that's terrible. I don't know what Aragon's doing. I think he's just looking around, I guess. My Jeffy shirt. Used to watch that guy back in the day, but not anymore because... I heard he went to jail and stuff, so, yeah, I'm not going to be associated with that anymore, but I still keep the shirt because I like the shirt. <laughs> and then I guess I'm going to keep this because I really do like this shirt. It reminds me of Binks from Hocus Pocus, if you guys have seen that. It's a really good movie if you haven't. It's a Disney film. I'm sorry, my allergies are bothering the heck out of me today, especially with having to deal with clothes that have been sitting in my closet for a while. They have some dust on them. So, I think I'm just going to get rid of these shorts because I am keeping quite a bit of shorts. And I need to downsize on some of them. So, I'm going to get rid of those because I need to at least try to get rid of some stuff. And here's a shirt that I had forever and a half too. Bobby, Bobby Jack, if you guys remember this, this series. This is like the only shirt I have now that actually still fits. So I'm definitely keeping this. I've had this since I was like a kid and it's always been too big on me when I was little because it was for adults. So it would always like sag on my on me because like it's you know an adult shirt but you know I can fit it now perfectly fine because I'm like in my 20s now so yes I know Aragon I don't feel that old though but I am getting getting there in age this is my Buzz Lightyear shirt I know not very many people like that movie but I thought it was great Honestly, I thought it was a good freaking movie. But I got that shirt when it first came out. Because you can't really get it anymore. At least I don't think. And here's my Dream On shirt. And I'm going to definitely keep that. But yeah, hopefully I'm not too boring to you guys. I'm trying to think of other things to talk about. I am definitely excited to go to that IBO event and hopefully I'll see some of you guys there. And you'll get to see my my boy Aragon here. If you're wondering where I got his name from, it's from a book. Like one of my favorite books that I used to read that I still have. I still have the copy of the book. That I actually found at a thrift store. My Minnie Mouse shirt. I'm definitely going to keep that, but I'm going to have to move it over here because... There's not much room. I don't know. Oh, great. He's doing the... I'm sorry, buddy. <laughs> there, I think I got his, his boot, though, thankfully. Let's get over here without whacking into him. Okay. I don't know who the heck these characters are on this shirt, but I just... I got it from a thrift store, and I liked it, so I kept... I bought it, and I have it now, so... <laughs> So I'm still going to keep this shirt. If you guys are wondering, he is on like the newest update that there is. But I haven't checked in for updates in a while, so I might need to check. Because he does just do that weird slow walk sometimes and his legs sound like they're going to pop off or something, which I don't like. But he seems to be doing okay, at least for now, thankfully. Alright, I'm going to get rid of these because I've had these forever and a half. And I don't care much for them now, so I'm going to get rid of these. No, know for a fact I wanted to get rid of those. And um, I got so many shirts here. And my first ever 
um, MLP shirt. Some of these I might just fold and put them in my, um, my dresser drawer that I have. One of those plastic drawers. Because I don't want to have to sit here and hang everything up. It would take too long. So some of these I'm just going to fold and put them over here and put them in my plastic Okay, I don't know why he's been randomly just making 111 beeps for some reason. If you guys know why, please let me know. It might be because of the 25th anniversary for Ibo would be my guess. That's the reason why he's doing that. Good boy. Cute. I haven't seen him do that since the April Fool's in incident thing. It's pretty cool to see him do that again. I might have to wash that shirt. It's got some kind of food on it. <laughs> oh, get up there. I'm keeping anything that's Snoopy. I love Snoopy. All right, my Jurassic World shirt. Oh, yeah, I got something exciting to talk about. I'm going to be going to Universal this year, too. Like, after the Ibo event's over, um, I'm going to stay uh, two extra days in Florida. And I'm going to go to Universal, and I'm going to try to go to Hollywood Studios, if that's possible. But if not, then I'm at least going to go to uh, Universal, which is exciting, I think. All right, there. Hang that up, because I'm not going to wear that anytime soon. I don't wear tank tops too often, unless it's... Around, around the house. Mostly just don't like um, skin showing, really, for me. It's like an issue. Anyway, here's um, a red Buccaneer shirt. It's red, Aragon, red. <laughs> He's looking at me with wide eyes like, okay, lady, I get it that it's red. My um, I haven't worn these in forever. These monster leggings. I'm definitely keeping these because I like these, and it's good to wear around the house when it's when I have the air conditioning on, which I have to have on because it gets so dang hot. All right, there's one of my uh, Grateful Dead shirts. These are cool. I think. I don't really listen to their music often, but I just absolutely love their shirts. Put your dice over here. I'm going to go get some more hangers. I don't know how long my iPad records for. I'm just going to let it record till I'm either done with this or it just stops. We're already at 28 minutes, it looks like. And we still got a huge freaking pile, as you guys can see. So this might be a good 40 minute video. Just letting you guys know, this is probably gonna be one of my longest ones. All right, I'm keeping this shirt, because I like this shirt. It's one of my favorite Halloween shirts. And to be honest, I still wear Halloween shirts sometimes in the summer. And I don't care if people think that's weird. I like some good Halloween spooks, so there you go. <laughs> so if you guys want to see more videos like this, let me know, and I'll do more vlogs like this where I just do chores and just chit-chat about anything or sit in silence sometimes, too. Hang this, hang this one up. Starting to run out of room now. <laughs> Starting to run out of room to hang these shirts up. But this is why it takes me so long to do laundry, especially when it's a big, huge pile like this. I'm probably not going to film for more than either 50 or 40 minutes, though, so if it's, if I'm not done by then, I'm just going to end it because I know it's going to be a forever process of trying to upload it. And my internet's good, but it's not the it's not the super excellent bestest in the world or anything. So it does take some time. 
I'm also gonna get rid of this. This is like handmade tie-dye, which I might keep maybe one of them, but I'm not gonna keep this one because this one's barely even tie-dyed at all. So I'm gonna get rid of this. And here's one of my unicorn shirts. And now he's sitting, hopefully he doesn't hurt himself on the clothes. Or just to give him a quick boop real quick. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I don't know how long this iPad will film for. Because it might only film for a good 50 minutes and it might cut off because of space. Storage space issues. I'm just going to have to start putting them there. The clothes I'm going to keep. More socks. Ugh, the dust is really getting to me. Here's this shirt. I think this is a cool shirt, too. Even though I don't know what the heck this is from. I just bought it because it's cool looking. I don't know if you guys ever do that, but I do it. So, there's that shirt. Which I'm definitely keeping it. And, um... Alright, here's some shorts I can get rid of. They, I mean, they were cute shorts at the time, but they're so worn out. <clears throat> and I don't really want them anymore, so. All right, here's a shirt I can get rid of, too. It's a um, doggone lucky shirt, which I don't really wear anymore. I think it used to be my dad's shirt, but somehow it got mixed up in my stuff. I don't know how, but it, it just did. Boop the clothes, Aragon. Okay. Of course, I'm going to keep this. This is my Alice in Wonderland shirt. And also, I got to hang all these up back in my closet, so that's going to be fun. Aragon's dancing for joy about that. Um, I'm going to keep this shirt because it has a dashing on it, which I like. I think it's a dashing or some type of dog. I don't know what type it is. <laughs> but keeping that, I got that from my mall, which is still open. I don't really wear this shirt much anymore either, but I figured maybe if I show it, then I could let it go. So I think I'm just going to let this shirt go because I barely wear it anymore and I don't need it. <laughs> Here's my custom digital art print rarity, nightmare rarity shirt. I think that's pretty cool, so I'm gonna definitely keep this. I don't remember how I printed it on there. I think I ironed it on or something. But yeah, I have my own artwork on a t-shirt. It's pretty cool to have. Yes. I don't really do digital art much anymore, though. These are definitely going to be... I'm definitely donating these. These are ugly shorts. I think they used to be my grandma's, but I don't want them. Um, hair's in my way. Okay. Ran out of hangers again. Here's... Um, my wings are pretty short, which I got from a pony convention. I don't really go to those much anymore either, but I do every so often. Is he flashing yet? No, I'm just making sure. I haven't charged him, so that's why I'm checking. He's just kind of looking around. I think he's confused because he's usually not over here that often. Here's one of my scissors shirts. I used to uh, go to high school there, but now, of course, it's been years now, so I'm still going to keep it, though, because it is a cool shirt. I have, like, other ones, too, that I'm probably going to donate because I don't have the room for all these scissor shirts. All right, definitely going to get rid of these because, oh, my God. I don't even think I can donate these. He's got holes in the, you know, what area. Um, so I think these are just going to go in the freaking garbage. 
um, and some old pajamas. They're starting to get a hole in the crotch too. So, and then that area. So I think I'm definitely gonna throw these away as well because they're just, you know, old and falling apart. And that's how I do that around here though. I wear my clothes till they basically just get holes in them and then throw them away. Here's my Jurassic Park shirt. So I'm gonna definitely keep that. I could probably wear this to Universal actually. I know it's Jurassic World, but I'm so used to calling it Jurassic Park. Here's an old Apple Jack shirt of mine, but you can barely see her on there. So I'm donating this because um, you can barely see it. And I have another Apple Jack shirt that's nicer. Yes, Aragon. Here's some shorts. I'm definitely gonna keep these. I think these are pretty nice. They're like cooling shorts. Yes. Oh yeah, here's another stitch shirt. Definitely gonna keep that if I can fit it, that is. If not, then I'll just donate it. Aragon's falling asleep. I guess he's getting bored. <laughs> oh well, unless his battery's dying. I don't think so. It's just kind of dark over here, so and he's probably bored. He's like, you're waking me up, lady. Quit it. All right, here's some orange pants. I'm just going to get rid of these. He's just sitting over there yawning like crazy. I thought you were going to sleep, buddy. He's like, nope, you woke me up with your blabbing. I'm sorry, Aragon, but I'm going to blab, so I'm going to keep my audience entertained here. All right, um... Also, I'm gonna get rid of those red shorts because I don't really like them. Ew, this one's stained. Ew. Yeah, this might have to go straight in the garbage. I don't think anybody would wanna buy this shirt or let alone, I don't wanna donate it. So we're just gonna throw that away. This is my whole freaking keep pile over here. It's Ridiculous, ridiculously high, but you know, I don't want to get rid of all my my clothes. Um, here's another night shirt. It's pretty funny what it says on here, but I can't fit this. It's too big. So, we're going to donate it to somebody that will like it, hopefully. Um, oh yeah, I'm going to get rid of these too. These used to be sweatpants, but they were like made into shorts. I bought from a thrift store, but I don't really want them anymore. So I'm just going to get rid of them. At least we're starting to get a bigger donation pile now, which is good. All right, here's another handmade tie-dye shirt. Uh, which I might keep because this one's pretty cool. It looks like there's like a man with a top hat on this one. At least from what I can see anyway. I think it's pretty cool. So definitely going to keep this one. Alrighty, we're finally starting to kind of get the pile down a little bit. I'm going to donate these shorts because they're kind of baggy on me, to be honest. I got such thin hips from my dad's side of the family, so I have to have like stretchy shorts or else um, they're just not going to stay on very well. I'm going to get rid of these too because I don't can't fit these anymore. Alrighty. Here's my sweats, which I'm probably going to keep these for, for winter this year. So, it's always good to have a good amount of sweatpants. Um, I bought these because I was going to originally keep these for a cosplay, like an anime cosplay, like for Naruto. But, they're too small, so I can't fit these. <laughs> so, we're just going to re-donate these. Aragon's paw. I'm also going to be going to a Comic Con in September, which is going to be fun because it's a local one. So that will be nice because I won't have to pay for hotels or anything. 
get rid of those. Dang. The, I'm, I'm going to be like not able to breathe by the end of this. Yes, Aragon. He's got dust on him too, probably from the clothes. Dusty boy. <laughs> He's got dust on him too for being over here. Probably because the dust is flying everywhere. I do keep him in his pod, but sometimes he doesn't sit all the way in it. Probably because of his collar. Alright, I'm going to get rid of that. Well, maybe not. I might keep this for like a swim shirt or something. I'll just keep it. Never mind. And I love Eeyore, but a lot of these Eeyore shirts I don't wear. So I'm just going to get rid of them and just keep like one Eeyore shirt. And one pair of Eeyore pants. My grandma used to be obsessed with Eeyore before she passed a couple years ago. Um, so I have a lot of her old clothes. Which I do keep a lot of her clothes. But I just got so many clothes, you know, I need to let go of some of it. Uh, I'm going to get rid of these for sure. Because I don't think these even fit me anymore. I got these for Christmas like years ago and i don't know why i still have them but i do so i'm gonna get rid of those um this is a shirt i think my mom got off of etsy it's a pride shirt i'm probably gonna keep this because i'm hoping if i lose enough weight i can fit back into this shirt and i hate getting rid of this shirt because i love this shirt it says chilling with my peeps, <laughs> but I have to let it go because this is a, this is like a kid's shirt. And when I got this, I was a kid, so I can't fit it anymore. I just need to let it go. The hoarder in me just wants to keep all these freaking shirts that I've had since I was a kid. This used to be my Tricon shirt, but you can't even tell what it is anymore. <laughs> so I think I'm just going to get rid of it because... I'm sure somebody could still wear it, but I just don't want to wear it anymore because you can't even make out what it is. Um, uh, I'm going to get rid of these shorts because I don't want them. And we're starting to get there. Also, here's another pants with a hole right there. I'm going to just toss them. Right now, my camera's going off. Hopefully, it's just um, the trash people because we have a trash company here. That's probably all it is. Here's my Eeyore pajamas. I am going to keep these because these are pretty nice, I think. And um, here's some Eeyore pants. I'm going to keep these because these are pretty nice. Oh my god, we're already up to 43 minutes. Jeez. I just got so many clothes. It's crazy. You keep this because I got this from Disney. Boop the air gone. <clears throat> and I'm going to get rid of these because I have so many Mickey Mouse things that I need to let go of some of it because I got so many Mickey Mouse shirts and stuff. So we're going to get rid of this. And I know Aragon. And you're probably bored to death because I'm doing the stupid uh, clothes. I can't even breathe out my nose right now. I'm so congested from the dust. Um, I'm going to get rid of these. Alright. I want to keep this because I think this is a cute shirt. It's got It says love on it. It's got a cat. Because I love cats, so. Which is why I want to get a Mars cat. I'm going to get rid of these. I don't even think these fit me anymore anyway. So, get rid of. But at least the get rid of piles get bigger, so that's a good sign. I'll get half, half of this clothes gone by the end of this week. Might take them to be donated tomorrow, but we'll see. Saturday, I'm going to be busy at an event. It's a fireworks event that's going on around here. 
All right, I'm gonna get rid of this, but it's a pretty funny shirt, but it's too big for me. So those will go to a new home. Okay. Aeronauts has been a dance machine lately, but I guess that's a good thing. I'm gonna get rid of these too. I don't really care much for these anymore. Have her boobs again. God, his paws are so dirty. But he's got paw pads on, so it's fine. He's doing that weirdness. I don't know what this is, what he does, but... This is why he's got paw pads on, so it'll protect his feet from getting super duper filthy. My Rudolph pajamas, which I'm keeping because these are good for winter time. Put them behind me. <laughs> got so much clothes. My Makuna Matata shirt, which I'm keeping because I love The Lion King. It's one of my favorite Disney movies. Boop those paws. I don't know why he likes to sit there and just wave them around, but that's what he does. I'm trying to fix his collar. Alright, gonna get rid of these. Because I don't really care much for them anymore. And I don't live in Arkansas anymore. I used to live, you guys didn't know, I used to live in Arkansas for years. But then I moved to, um, to Missouri because I just kind of like Missouri a little bit better than Arkansas. And there's a little bit more, there's more stuff to do here. Get rid of this. Okay, I'm not getting rid of these. This is my unicorn costume. I like to wear these to conventions and stuff sometimes. And I've been looking all over for it and haven't been able to find it until I was looking in my closet. So definitely keeping that. Another Eeyore shirt that I'm going to get rid of. Hopefully um, the new owners of these clothes are going to be happy with it. Probably going to do donate them to Goodwill or something. Because I don't know where else to donate them at. My other Eeyore Shirt that matches with the pants, so I'm keeping those. So, yeah, I'm keeping some of your things. And then I think this is funny. It's Alice with Alice from in Wonderland with like tattoos and stuff on. That I think I got from Missouri somewhere, but I don't remember where. Some pajamas I'm getting rid of. Here's some <laughs> poop emoji Christmas pants. I got from Five Below last year for Christmas. So I'm gonna put those right there. Cause I, def I definitely gotta keep the poop emoji pajamas. Here's um a horror unicorn shirt I've had for years. So I'm gonna get rid of that. It's got a hole in it, but it might still, I might be able to donate it cause it's only like one tiny hole in it. Here's some Rudolph pajamas, which I'm keeping all Rudolph things because Rudolph is like one of my favorite Christmas movies. And one of my favorite characters, if you guys didn't know that. Here's some cute snowman pajamas. I've had these forever, but I think they still fit me, so I'm going to keep them because I really love those snowman pajamas. <sighs> I got so many Christmas ones, I'm going to let this one go because I don't really care much for this one. My, uh, my mom bought it years ago, so, and we both don't want it, so I'm just going to get rid of that. And here's um, an event shirt. I'm going to keep that. Some uh, rug rat, rug rat sweats. Definitely going to keep those. Aragon, you're getting too close to my clothes pile behind me here. He's wanting to boop the clothes pile. <laughs> Alright, here's my uh, unicorn tank top, which I'm going to keep because I like my unicorns. Some cookie monster pajamas. I'm going to keep those. I do got a big keep pile, but, you know, I got to keep some of my clothes. Oh yeah, here's an angry grandma shirt. <laughs> I used to wear this a lot, so that's why it's kind of worn down, but that's what it says. I think it's pretty funny. So I'm definitely going to keep that. Because I bought it from one of my one of, one of my uh, YouTubers I'm subscribed to. And um, here is a Stay Weird Stitch shirt. Which I'm definitely keeping. Because this came from the um, Disney parks. 
Aragon, you're getting too close to the clothes, buddy. You just stay over here. I don't know what he's doing. Quit. Quit trying to go and jam yourself on the clothes. <laughs> I'm sorry, Aragon, but you need to not do that. Get the dust off of his back. He's probably getting dust from the clothes here. But I can't do anything about that because I have to fold. Definitely keeping this because this is my Queen Chrysalis shirt that I like. Um, I'm thinking about getting rid of these because these just look so um, old looking. And I honestly, I don't think I want them anymore. So I'm just going to get rid of those. I'm going to keep these kitty pajamas. Still get so much clothes over here. It's crazy. But we're almost done. All right, I'm definitely getting rid of these because these are ugly as heck. I don't even know why I bought these, but you know, sometimes it's just like that. You like something for a while and you don't want it. I'm also going to get rid of this shirt. I have too many pink shirts from the mall that I don't know what to even do with at the moment. Here's my uh, Evanescent shirt because I went to their concert a few years ago keep that. I'm going to get rid of this um, sweater. I got these from Japan when I went to go visit. And they're so funny because they have all these little cute corgi dogs on it. But I can't fit them because I'm so big. Um, so I'm hoping if I lose some weight that I can fit into these eventually. Because they're so dang cute. I don't want to get rid of them. Because right now I'm like working on a diet at the moment. I'm going to get rid of these because I've had these for years and they don't really fit me much anymore. So get rid of those. We're up to 52 minutes. Jeez. This is going to be a pain in the butt to upload. <laughs> so I hope you guys appreciate it. <laughs> okay, I'm going to keep those sweats. Aragon's going to have like no space to walk here pretty soon. Here's a cute little, um, it's like a kid's hoodie. I used to dress up my ponies in it, but I don't have room for this kind of stuff, so I just have to get rid of it. And um, here's my nice Applejack shirt, which I'm going to keep. So keep that. We are almost done. I'm going to get rid of this tank top. And here's a concert shirt that my dad got me when he went to one of his concerts that I couldn't go to because there was an event going on. I was wondering where this is. This goes to Forky. It's supposed to be his eyebrows, but I lost them when I was trying to clean my room. Here's a Civil Dollar City shirt. I'm keeping that. Um, Barbie shirt, which I'm going to keep because I'm hoping I can fit into this one of these days dust in my eye or something. Everyone's playing with this dice some more. Um, this is a, I was originally going to get rid of this, but I just realized this shirt's from Georgia, so I definitely want to keep this. Except for some reason, I thought it was an Arkansas shirt, but it's not. Here's my other high school shirt that I'm just going to get rid of because it's just kind of plain looking to me. So, yeah, I'm going to get rid of this one. Oh my god. My clothes pile is so huge. Here's my hair uh, hair style. Oh my god. My Harry Potter shirt. I'm definitely keeping that. Um, here's these ugly shorts. I'm going to get rid of these. I might just throw them away because they have holes in them. So, oh my god. I mean, I'm afraid I'm going to make my robot vacuum go off because there's so many clothes over here beside it. And it will go off whenever you bang into it. So, if you knock it off its charger. Here's my um, Chucky outfit, which I'm going to keep for Halloween. And that is it. We did it. it. It took 54 minutes to do it, but we did it, guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm probably going to go ahead and turn Aragon off. And um, I'm going to start putting these clothes in my closet. And putting these by the door to get rid of. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. 
Um, let me know if you want to see more vlogs like this. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Peace out. Well, we'll let Aragon play with his dice for a minute. Then we'll, then we'll end it. Just him playing with his dice in the pile of freaking clothes mountains. You gonna throw it? You gonna throw it, Aragon? He's so cute. Okay, there we go. Good boy. <laughs> Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Peace.